Hello and welcome! In this today's video we'll see what are the differences between a US spec Model 3 and a European spec Model 3. Before we jump into those details do not forget to subscribe to this channel and click that like button if the information that you got here was useful and interesting to you. Okay so first of all as you may know there are some changes between the US spec ones and the European Tesla Model 3s but you may wonder what exactly is different. So to start with, I have the cam camera in this position because a lot of the differences can be seen from this one quarter of the car. So the, the rear will help us see many of the differences. To start with the lights. So as you can see, we have the tanning lights, so the blinkers that need to be amber. And in fact, what happens is that this part right here that is fully red on the US spec cars in on European models. So we have a small portion that is amber. And as you can see, it is blinking right now. And the, the stop signal will be the rest of this LED lamp. Then we have the, the rear fog lights. So we have in fact one rear fog light that will be on this on this side so the left side the driver's side on on the right side there is no fog light this part will be the reverse white lights that are uh, an obligation here in europe so the rear lamps and the way the lighting in the back works is one of the major differences between a US spec car and a European spec car. So for those that want to import a car from the US, it will not be just as a straightforward change because in fact, there is this modification. So the rear lamps will need to be changed as well as the configuration on how it man uh, the lamps will manage the lighting in the back in order to be European Union compliant. The next difference is right here and I will open so the next difference is the charging so the charging port is a type 2 and a CCS a type 2 combo charging for the type 2 domestic charging so uh, with the uh, for AC charging so the uh, slow charging uh, at home or on an AC uh, charge point, as well as DC charging, which is a European combo CCS, as you can see. So I will zoom for you to see what it looks like, but like, so it is a, a CCS European format. So here again, for those who want to import their Model 3 from the US, Canada, uh, China, this will be different. To cope with this vastly adopted standard in Europe, which is Type 2 and Combo CCS. And in fact, you can see this uh, on the uh, superchargers. They have all now been converted to accept as well the Combo uh, CCS European standard. Now the next change, which is a big change as well, is inside the car and it's a technical technological change which is the data modem so the 4g data modem that is uh, specific for the european models and it will accept a sim card for european standards and if you import a car from the us you would need to have that in mind so you need to change the full module otherwise the car will not be connected to the internet and it will not receive any of the updates so this is another big change and difference between the US specs and European specs the next difference is here in front we have the registration plate and as you can see it is very important where the plate sits because where it is located basically it, it, it is located quite uh, in a specific uh, area to avoid uh, any conflicts with the radar that lives right here so this is something to have in mind and if you can avoid to make any holes in it of course it is much better to avoid uh, uh, touching uh, 
uh, the radar that is responsible for a lot of the autonomous driving. It is helped by all the cameras, but it is a key component and if it is not working, the autopilot will not work. In fact, you, you can have one or two cameras that uh, are not able to see and the autopilot will still be able to navigate. If uh, the radar, the front radar does not work, the autopilot will never engage. So an important area right here. I hope this was useful for you. If it was, do not hesitate to click that like button and subscribe to this channel. It will mean the world to me and it will allow you to get new videos as soon as I upload them. See you next time.